Okay. Jim, I'm so excited that you're with us today, and I'm so proud of you, you know, because we often hear about homosexuality, we hear about mm -hmm. gays, we hear about um, lesbians, we hear about people making a choice and saying, well, it's a choice. No, I was born this way. Mm -hmm. And last week we saw your testimony, we heard your testimony. Many are actually tuning in today for the first time. But for those of you that have not seen the program last week and didn't see Jim's testimony, we actually heard that there are millions and hundreds of thousands of people that are coming out of homosexualities through Jesus Christ. Right. And only through him can they be free. That's right. But however, Jim, as you know, many people do not want to believe that it's a choice. Mm -hmm. They want to still think that they're born that way. And again, just for those that didn't watch us last week, what do you say? Are you born that way or is it a choice? Well, it, it, I used to believe that people were born that way, but I've, uh, the Lord stepped into my life and turned my life around. I learned that people are not born that way, that uh, there is no genetic evidence uh, or scientific proof that people are born that way. And um, there are hundreds of thousands, if not millions of people who are walking out of homosexuality or leaving that lifestyle. And, and, um, and if they can do it, you can do it too. Yeah, and obviously you have done it. That's right. Because I'm you live that life and you're married. Mm -hmm. You're currently married. Mm -hmm. You're actually married to your your first wife, uh -huh. which is actually your only wife, right. after leaving your wife, uh -huh. to go engage in homosexuality. Right.